Given the size of today's modern machinery, an equipment breakdown in the field can create a big challenge. For his tech segment this week, Chad Colby looks into a tool that can help keep that repair a little bit safer for folks on the ground. I love great ideas that come from the shop, literally. Check this out. This is the Universal Tractor Jack from Flatland Farmer Innovations. What a simple, safe way to get your tractor airborne. As you can see here, one guy slid the jack underneath it, lifted it up with the three-point. He's putting in the safety jacks, and their crew's going to work. Now, they're going to make a short job of swapping these tracks over, but what I wanted to show you is just how simple this jack system works. They got their tracks swapped, and look, he's pulling up the jack stands, and he's going to lower that down, slide it right back out. This works on, obviously, any tractor with a three-point. It can be used with or without a quick hitch. It's fully adjustable, so it's going to work on whatever kind of spacing you have at the back of your tractor. It's got high-capacity caster wheels, which are more than enough to support the weight of the tractor. Uh, you do need a minimum drawbar clearance to make that work of a little over 15 inches. The cool part is it makes simple work of whether you're changing tracks, checking bogey wheels like these guys were doing here before they swap tracks, or changing duels, or probably the biggest thing is what about any kind of service work on the back of a tractor? It's a safe, stable way to support the back of the tractor while you're underneath working. And there's no load on the hydraulic system because once you get it raised and it's sitting on the jacks, there's essentially no weight on the three-point. I just think this is super cool. You can learn more about these guys if you go out to flatlandfarmer.com. And I've got one more product from these guys I got to show you is look at this. They had another problem, and that was they wanted some more capacity with their mini hoppers putting in plots. So they made these little extensions, and these look super cool as well. You can learn more about these guys at the Farm Progress Show. They'll be in the Barker Implement booth. For This Week in Agribusiness, I'm Chad Colby. Thank you, Chad. And folks, don't go anywhere. We'll have more This Week in Agribusiness coming up after this.